good YouTube? It's your boy Cash. Yes, I'm back again with another banger for y'all. Yeah, man. I said I'm back again with another banger for y'all, boys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got me some iced tea from Wawa's. You diggity dig. I put ice in it to make it colder. You me? Let me get a little swig. So for today's video, I'm be doing a little story time to my upcoming high schoolers. You dig? I'm gonna just talk to y'all a little bit. You feel me? Since I know y'all coming up to high school, y'all fresh meat into high school. You mean? Y'all don't really know what to expect and those of you that's in high school I'm gonna just put y'all on a game, you feel me? On a, whatever grade y'all going to 9th, 10th, 11th, 12th Those of y'all that's a senior, congratulations, man But hey To those of y'all that's going in the ninth grade I just wanna say congratulations on all your success Good luck I wish nothing but positivity and blessings to y'all And Things that y'all need to know going into high school. Y'all will be the freshmen. Twin. Y'all are fresh meat. You feel me? You can't go in there. Alright. This for every freshman, bro. You cannot go in high school thinking you the big dog. Because listen, I'm going to tell you now. As a freshman, I tried it. I tried going in thinking, yo, I'm him. You feel me? I'm him dunking. I was thinking I was Peter with it. You feel me? But I think I was Peter and shit. That died instantly. It was like, yo, who this little boy think he is? Like, go ahead, get up out of here, little brother. So he was like, get up out of here, little brother. I'm like, damn, that's how y'all coming. So can't go in there thinking you run the show, you the big dog, you feel me, you run the school. Nah, cause y'all just stepping in. The work, gonna breeze through that. It's easy. Tell you right now, the work for high school, ninth grade year is dumb easy. Now, the schoolies do not eat the schoolie, bro. Those y'all that got like, what's it called? Get, damn, I forgot. Out of school lunch. Those y'all that get out of school lunch. Well, I don't know if you get that ninth grade year. I think you get that at tenth. Cause I had a tenth grade year. Cause I started driving in tenth grade year. So yeah, I got it in tenth grade year. So, those of y'all got out of school lunch, I mean, you never know, it might change now, so, you might get out of school lunch now. But I'm letting y'all know right now, if you eat the schoolie, they will put y'all on blast. Now, for the fit, ninth grade year, you wanna, I say you wanna really show out, you feel me? Because that's your ninth grade year, so you wanna show like, alright, you could dress. Me, my name right here, I could dress all my whole high school year, I knew how to dress. Nobody could not tell me nothing, bro. From the from the big uh 1996 eight ball jacket. Mama, I'll put that picture up right here. The eight ball jacket, bro. Nobody was topping me with that. I swear to God. You gotta know how to dress your ninth grade year. I'm telling you. Cause the top grade are gonna look to see like, alright, let me see how they dress. Let me see what they about. Bro, I'm telling you now. Don't be aggravating. Twin. Middle school and high school is two different things, twin. I'm telling you, do not go in there aggravate because I'm telling you, you will get picked on. You feel me? You want to make at least, you want to have a squad going in there. Like, alright. Your ninth grade year, you want to have at least a group of boys and girls mixed together in your little circle and stay with that circle. Have that same circle at your lunch table. Feel me? Make sure y'all got classes together. You feel me? Mostly it's gonna be your little circle that's you came from middle school with, or those y'all that's transferring. You gotta make them friends. You feel me, twin? You gotta. Now those y'all that's a transfer student that's going into this new school or whatever. I'm telling you now, you gotta know how to dress. It's all about dressing, twin. It's all about dressing. Cause ninth grade year, they're gonna see like, ah, right, you the fresh kid, you the new kid. Yo, my senior year in this new school, well, my old school before I graduated, bro, everybody was watching me. 
I had to show up my name for my uh, 12th grade because it's like, I I came in, I came into a whole new different uh, school system. You feel me? They don't know me. I don't know nobody. So what I do my first day? Came in with Balenciagas or Kasubis, uh, a Mary shirt, no, a Dior shirt, I think, and I had a uh, Palm Angel V Lone shirt, a uh, hoodie, and I had my Gucci glasses. You feel me? You feel me? And I bought tattoos out too at the same time. They like, oh, once I took my hoodie off, they said, oh snap, he got tattoos. So boom, you feel me? You feel? Me? I think my ninth grade year, I had tattoos too. Yeah, but. Now y'all know now, it's all about dressing. Ninth grade, yeah. Tenth grade, those of y'all that's in tenth grade. I'ma still say y'all still a little youngest, cause you know why? Y'all got the eleventh grade bullying y'all, y'all got the seniors bullying y'all. But now y'all get to bully the ninth graders. <laughs> y'all get the little pick on the little ninth graders or whatever. I'll say like, find your little, find your little boot thing you can walk around the school with, you feel me? Walk home with. You feel me? Cause like, you don't wanna be like, all right, I'ma let you know now. Motion team, you do not wanna go into high school being lonely at all. You don't. Cause that's, you just walk into high school being lonely, it's just like, damn bro, I feel for you. Now, those of you that play sports, they got it way easier. Cause you know why? They gonna be on your body, whether you ugly or not. <laughs> they gonna be on your body. But the work for 10th grade year, still easy. You don't really gotta do too much 10th grade year. You don't gotta really dress like that. You could really, I say you could throw on sweatpants here and there, every other day, or Crocs, Yeezy slippers. Cause it's like, ah, right, they got a glimpse of you in 9th grade year. Still stay with that same circle though. For sure, Ski Twin. You wanna stay with that same circle. Cause, so like that little circle with you for your whole high school year, they're not gonna switch up on you. They're gonna stay with you. Whether y'all argue, fight, not, y'all gonna always stay together. Y'all gonna go to parties together. Y'all gonna be on the phone together. Y'all gonna be talking to girls to, uh, together, boys, whatever. You feel me, twin? Y'all gonna be going out together. So, y'all gonna call them your dogs. Now to my 11th graders. That's when y'all yeah, really want to get on y'all yeah, schoolwork now, you feel me? You want to be like, all right, this my 11th grade year. I'm 16, 17. What should I do when I graduate this in another year? Because what am I going to be? Where am I going to go the next three years after that? You feel me? You want to think like that in 11th grade. So you want to figure out what you want to do. Now your 11th grade year. I say that's the year like I right, you about to hit senior so now you a teen like you're not like you're really a teen now you feel me you're not no more kid you're not running around the school you're not chasing the tenth graders the uh, ninth graders no more you feel me not screaming early in the morning you feel me because that's what that's what the, you feel me the youngest do they scream early in the morning or whatever so I'll say eleventh grade year you could dress by me eleventh twelfth grade you could dress by me. You know why? Cause like that's the same thing. Like, all right, 11th grade, you gotta focus. Like you gotta lock in for real. Like you really gotta lock in on your future, your career. Cause I feel like we in a whole different year now. So it's like you gotta get on your mental stuff as you in your 11th grade year. Cause you know why? It's like think about it like this. You hit 12th grade year, right? Now you like, damn. Do I want to go to college and do this? Or what am I going to be? You don't want to be stressing about it. You feel me, Twin? You want to have a plan and a backup plan. Me, I don't got no damn backup plan. I really don't. I'm going to keep it big with y'all. I only got y'all. You feel me? And I love y'all to death. Baby, Twin. I'm going to rob for y'all. Other than that, I don't got no backup plan. But like I said, those of y'all that's really want to lock in with yourself and want to say, you know what? I want to be that 5% out of my school that become a millionaire or I want to be successful the next three years that I graduate high school. You feel me? I say 11th grade year, you want to get a job too. You want to start getting some bread. Even the, even the, the end of 10th grade year going into 11th, like that summer, you want to get a job because you want to have some type of bread. You feel me? 
I feel like you don't want to be like broke, growing, going into school. You want to have your own bread so you can buy shoes. Cause word, 11th grade year, you gotta have a shoe game. You cannot be doing, all right. Even for the holidays that y'all be celebrating in school. Like Halloween, I say 11th grade. Dressing up though. Mm. You're a little too grown to be dressing up, Tony. I'm gonna keep it real with you. I'm gonna keep, see, I'm gonna keep it real with you. You're a little too grown to be dressing up at 11th grade. But 9th grade, you get a pass because you feel you fresh meat. 10th grade, you get a pass because you still like the baby to school. You feel me? But 11th grade, I feel like, all right, gang, it's time to bully lock in on this real world because you about to step in it after 12th grade. Now, 12th grade hit. You got graduation. You got prom. You got senior rehearsals. You got all these projects. You got essays. You got uh, SATs. Listen, there's a good chance somebody's trying to hack your website right now. You got uh, to see if you can graduate tests. I'm talking about enterprise grade security. You keep it being with you. You got at least seven different tests you got to take before you graduate tests. Twin. Twin. Hey, my kid, talk today. Twin, you got at least seven different tests. And I feel like, see, my senior year, I ain't do nothing. I'm going to keep it real with you. I ain't do not a damn thing. I just sat there, went to school, dress fly, had my cam all the time, and I gotta see what my things say in the yearbook. I'm gonna see. I'm gonna call somebody real quick. Cause if I have, if I'm going to yearbook, I'm gonna see. Hold on. Plus, Hello? Hey, I'm recording right now. Do you did you get a uh, yearbook? Number one rule in no. Nobody is 100% on that. You said no. no. Okay. All right. Thank you. All right. All right. So let's call the next person. And that's not all. It's time for response. Damn. Who do I have? See, I don't really have nobody number. Your business stays up and running. The team gets it done. I don't know if this is a number anymore. Your call. Yeah, nah. See, I don't really got nobody number from that school. Matter of fact, I think I... I think I do. I think I do. Let me see. Damn. Yeah, it's over. I think in my yearbook it said I know how to dress and matter of fact Instagram I know somebody that got it Rod it with the chopper the big old blocker blocker niggas really want it and I ain't a block like hotter whoa whoa didn't he think he knows but I think my yearbook said I know how to dress and, and I think it said YouTuber. Future YouTuber. I gotta see. I'm calling somebody right now. Hang it with the blogger. The big old blogger blogger. Aim it at your flogger. The nigga talk a knocker. Knock a rocker pocker. Aim it at your popper. Hang a blocker blocker and I aim it like a shotter. Takata. My daughter, my aim it like a daughter. My shooter and my tighter like my kuma I was louder. Oh, that was hard. I know y'all like cash. What did you just say? All right, so nobody's answering. I don't know anybody that got a yearbook. But I think Ma said I know how to dress and shit like that. But other than that, I feel like yeah, senior year, you really got to lock in because... Well, you only got to lock in for a for You could just like... First market period, second market period, you could really just bullshit. You could really breeze through that like, all right. Now, those of y'all that don't like to show up to school, those of y'all like to smoke. I ain't gonna knock your little hustle with the smoke, because you feel me? My high school year, whoo, I was out of this world at every day. Bro, every day before school, bro, was zooted high school year. I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. 
I'm not even gonna lie to y'all, twin. I was really the Zaza master back in high school. I don't know how was I getting this much bread in high school, but yo, every week I had, <laughs> I had food and I had Zaza high school year. What else? Going to school, you know what? I, I seen a lot of people this year who messed up like they graduation rehearsals, graduation, like walking on stage and all that for like late uh, absences and shit like that. Bro, just go to school, bro. You can bullshit your way through, twin. I'm telling you, you don't really gotta, you feel me? I mean, you gotta work hard in your 11th grade year. That's the year I say, I really say, lock in. Turn that GPA to a 4.0, twin. Cause, man, for you, I already know. Y'all gonna really be playing around with your friends, running around the school, running away from the security guard. What? Oh, my mother. I was, I had them security chasing me. Every day my ninth grade, I swear to God, every day my ninth grade year, I would troll. I would dead troll the school. I said, make, I said, at a certain time, boom. What? Run through the whole school. Just had a security chase me, knock on doors. Listen, don't be like me in your ninth grade yet. My ninth grade, I was all year long, bro. Just ding dong ditch and stuff. Throwing stuff at people. Bro, look, I got videos, twin. I literally got videos of me being reckless my ninth grade year. Hold on, I'm gonna show y'all because y'all think I'm capping. Y'all think look cash should be capping. Look, when I tell you these stories, I be so for real, twin. Yo, I swear, don't be like me when you're ninth grade year. Let me find these videos for y'all. All right, look. Do you work? Do you work? Look, don't them gang signs, gang. Look, bro, I was over here copping shoes. Gang, I was over here copping shoes on different, bro. You remember when Yeezy's first got popped in ninth grade year, bro? I was over here shopping, bro, instead of paying attention. What else? I'm Look. Hold on. Because it's fat. Let me turn my brightness down so y'all can see. All right. Look. I used to love playing around. Hit people in the head with stuff, bro. I was bad my ninth grade year. I'm going to say, your ninth grade year, y'all going to be bad. Listen, don't be a little horn dog in ninth grade year either, because y'all start seeing all the older girls. Bro, one thing about me, my ninth grade, uh, I have all the old shorties on my body. I had this one shorty, her name was. I ain't even gonna air her out like that, but I'm gonna call her M. Yo. <laughs> we did a hell of stuff behind lockers, bro. Her name was M. M, if you watching this, my bad. I don't wanna air you out. And what's crazy is it's a teacher that's named her name. I used to say that. What? I used to rate pipe shorty and the teacher at the same time. Gay. Yeah. 10th grade though, like I said. Just chill, bro. Yeah, Cause I already know y'all gonna be just like the ninth graders running around the school, being loud, screaming with your friends, making TikToks. Just vibe out, twin. You feel me? 11th grade, yeah, lock in with your lifestyle. Lock in with who you want to be in life. You feel me, twin? Don't let nobody stop you. Listen, 11th grade is that year you really got to lock in. 12th grade, I'll say third market period is when you really want to lock back in because that's when you start taking all the start state tests, projects. Bro, I pay. I ain't even gonna lie to y'all, twin. My 12th grade, yeah, I paid people. I didn't even pay people. I told them I was gonna pay them. Never paid them. Never paid them. I said, yo, can you do this for me? Blah, blah, blah. Watch. Because I like to really pull up my receipts. I know she's going, she never busy. <laughs> she always go to school. She, she in college. Told you. Hello? Hey. What up, though? Nothing. I feel a little dumbass on, <laughs> on fucking TikTok. Wow. Oh. What I was gonna say? Something in the wrong for you, Kate. And I'm like, look at this nigga here. <laughs> what I was gonna say though? What? 
uh, Alright, so how many times did I used to call you to do my work in uh, just my senior year? <laughs> Yo, because I'm recording right now. And I just wanted to know how long, how many times did I ask you? Almost every fucking day. Same. But look, a young nigga made it out the project. Now I made it to the trenches. Yeah, yeah, word. You missed that you were supposed to come to the fucking family reunion. We would have had so much fucking fun. What you mean? Wait, put me on. We would have had so much fun. Guess what I tried? You know them Cardi B lip shots? Yeah. Yeah, I had tried them. They were good in every flavor. I know, you've been sending me all your videos. I didn't. I had looked through the message and I was like, I did send them all the videos. Yo, you know, you know what's crazy? Every time you send me videos, I never respond. You an asshole. I never send you before. Yo, you know what's crazy? I never respond. I just look at them. Yeah, and then sometimes you call. Alright, the next time I'm in my next minute, I end up going ghost for whole three days. Crazy. But look, let me finish making this video. Sometimes I'm gonna call you back. You hear me? Alright. What a time, my little brother. Alright, I'ma catch you now. What fuck they got going on? I told y'all, see, I used to call her every day to do my work. Alright, that's a thick, that's a thick dark skin job. You Dazer, Dazer, Dazer! You feel me? That's a thick up, stick up. This booty look like two. Whipples. Like them things in the, in the ocean, the whipples, the. Trying to show you, but listen, back to the story. Stop getting distracted. I'm trying to show you, but like I said, lock in your eleventh grade year and third market period of your senior year, because that's when you really want to start taking life serious. You don't want to be, you don't want to be stressing. Yo, listen, if y'all get heartbroken, bro, keep it, Peter. Don't be all sad. Don't be all depressed. I'm telling you. Don't crash out, bro, for a shorty, bro. Because at the end of the day, I'm let you know now. But don't crash out over no mail, you feel me? Because at the end of the day, it's your world. Can't none of them stop you. Can't none of them bring you down, you feel me? Because you know why? Because you's a king and you's a queen. You feel me? Can't nobody bring you down, king and queen. Come on, the brother and the sister. It's your world, you feel me? What a time out. And listen, those y'all that's gonna be having beefs. If y'all thinking about beef with the older kids, I'm letting you know now, they're gonna bully y'all. Ninth graders, they will bully y'all. Bro, even first coming in, they're gonna bully y'all. My ninth grade, yeah, they knew not to bully me, cause you know why? <laughs> I wasn't playing no games. I was ready to fight a nigga. What? Well, my first fight in my ninth grade was crazy. It was over a female that I don't even talk to, twin. I never dated, bro. Crazy, right? But listen, I'm letting y'all know now. Please don't fight over no shorty, bro. Don't do it. And no female, don't fight over no male. Cause think about it. It's ninth grade year, 10th grade year, 11th grade year. What the hell are they gonna put? What the hell are they gonna take you? Where the hell are they gonna? You feel me? I mean, yeah, you can find your little love, your little love in there, but twin, please don't crash out. If they can go left, please. Thank you, thank you. Let you know now, because at the end of the day, you gonna still be successful. You will still be a superstar. You gonna still travel the world. You gonna still chase your dreams, cause you know why. I'm gonna be by your side. I'm gonna guide you through it all, no matter what. You feel me? My worst thing I did was get into it. I ain't even gonna say it was the worst thing because it was a lesson. I ain't even gonna learn. That relationship was a lesson. I feel like getting a relationship my 10th grade year all the way to the very beginning of my senior year and then ending, ending it right there, that broke me. That made me crash out and realize who I really was. You feel me? Because at one point, I was, like, doing everything for her, bro. Like, 
I I said I want to go to college for her. You feel me? I want to be a doctor. <laughs> Twin. I said I wanted to be a doctor. No one did well I can't fix nobody. I don't even know how to do CPR. I say, gang, I would be a doctor. I would be, bro, I don't get, bro. <laughs> I was sticking to that, the brother. I was really sticking to that. No cap, and I don't know why, bro. Then I really, then I realized, like, after the break, bro, I realized who I really was, bro. Like, you feel me? Take shit. I told myself, I'm gonna make it out of my mama's house and I'm going back to the trenches. It is what it is. And that's what I did. Now I'm in New Orleans. I'm trying to show y'all. We made it out the projects. But, like I said, chase your dreams your senior year too, because you know why? That's when you're gonna start seeing who your real people is. A lot of, I, I would say, even if y'all like don't talk no more, a lot of people are gonna fade away from you once you graduate. A lot of people. Even before that, bro, a lot of people will fade away from you. You got a yearbook? I hate when people text me. Like, why are you texting me? Just call, I called you for a reason, like. Don't get smacked up. You feel me? My dad always sending me stuff on Instagram. Look, look how much stuff my dad sent me on Instagram a day. I mean, we both send each other stuff a day, but gang, this is bad. Like I said, you want to chase your dreams. What is bed bug, bed? It has bed bugs? I was wondering if I, you can hold it for me. Uh -huh. But... I don't really got too much to worry about, bro. High school year is gonna be a breeze. Cause I know some of y'all gonna be like, ah, right, y'all gonna be scared to go in. I know some of y'all like worried. Yo, gang, you don't gotta get worried. Cause you know why? They still gonna bully y'all. You gonna bully them back. You feel me? You just hold your ground. Your high school year hold your ground. It's like solitary climate. <laughs> Yo, don't eat the schoolie. That's all I'm telling y'all, bro. Bring snacks with y'all, bro. Every Yo, I forgot to tell you that. Do not go to school without any snacks, bro. And listen, 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 listen. If y'all get the opportunity to take early release, take that shit. Take that motherfucking shit. Cause you know what? You not want to be there till 2.45, 1.30. Hey, those of y'all that even got to be to school till 3.30, bro, you do not want to be in there that long. Those of y'all that play sports, you know how it feel. You want to go to school early, you want to go to school at like whatever, 6 o'clock, you want to get out of that 10.30. Me, I used to go in at 6 o'clock and I get out at 10.08. Literally, every, since 10th grade year. Gang. I ain't never stayed there late as hell, cause you know why? I couldn't even get through, I barely got through high school, bro. Not even barely, I, I feel like I really made through it, cause like I tried a little bit, but at the same time, huh? <clears throat> my 11th grade year, 12th grade, I said, I'm chasing my dreams for real, for real. I know what I really wanna be. And so, that's what I did, little brother. That's what I did, little brother. Now I'm telling you right now. Do that. Get to it, twin. Let's lock in. You got another month of summer. Then you got school coming up, twin. So get what? I want to see you making money. I want to see you doing something that make you happy your senior year. I want you to come back and be like, yo, Cash, I did it. So guess what I'm going to say? Congratulations, little brother. Congratulations, little sister. I told you. You was gonna be successful Cause you know why? You paid attention You understood your school year Yo, I feel like the classes that you really wanna take Gym Language, arts, and math That's the best I feel like Yo, my math teacher my senior year was the best I ain't even gonna lie I feel like everybody else was a pain in the ass Cause Sheesh 
it wasn't no really no cute females in my school so i really couldn't really bag nobody this year but other than that yo keep it peter gay sis keep it hood you feel me always hold your ground man don't let nobody try to walk over you don't let nobody tell you what to do bro i'm letting you know now bro don't let nobody tell you what to do because as soon as they start telling you what to do they're gonna try to take advantage of you bro you know the people trying to take advantage of me bro i said hell no i was not going for it twin i'm letting you know now bro lock in focus up twin it's your world hey those of you guys about to be seniors Pay attention, lock in, cause this your last year. There's no more school after that. There's no more high school. You're in the real world where you could either go to college or you gotta start a job or you gotta figure out what you wanna do with your life. You feel me, twin? Lock in, bro. It's your world, baby boy, baby girl. But now y'all know now. You only get one chance, so take it and figure out your craft. That's what you want. I'll figure out your whole high school year. That's what you want to do. Figure out your craft. I'm going to leave y'all with that. Figure out your craft, man. Other than that, I love y'all. Good luck your high school year. Good fucking luck. Bro, even if y'all got an annoying teacher, bro, call me up, bro. DM me on Instagram. Y'all already know the Instagram. It's going to be right there. It's going to be... Right there, man. Just hit the follow button on Instagram, man. Just hit the follow button. You feel me? DM me, man. And I got some more advice for you. Whatever y'all want to know. Work-wise, how to pass your drop. Hey, I got. I still got the answers for the 10th graders. Those y'all about to take a driver test. I got you. DM me on Instagram. I'll send it to y'all. Don't let your teacher tell. Don't let your teacher find out. I gave y'all the stuff. Let them be like, damn, you did that. I got y'all though, twin. DM me on Instagram, those that I want it, you feel me? But other than that, I'm about to make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and turn that post notifications on. Yeah. Hey, roll to 2K. Roll to 2K. Thank y'all for the 1K ski. Thank y'all for the 1K ski. And I ride it with a tasty. Hey, she thought she was my baby. I turned into a hay ski. Hey, the baby thinks she made me. I tell the bitch that ate me. Whoa. I'm smoking on the Tracy. I'm riding with the Daisy. These niggas really hate me. I walk with the Tracy. Tied it like a daddy. I said I'm tied it like I'm young and maskey. Other than that, I'm out. I'm gonna catch you on the next one.